As usual, as usual. Department of Ancient History, log entry 238. I have devoted Cock. years of my life to the search for an ancient occult formula intended to reverse the flow of time. I am trying to decipher the writings of long forgotten scribes, and I believe I have made a significant find in one of the old alchemical notes we found on Vernum, an island off the coast of Norway. I have brought all the material I have gathered to my home in order to study it without any distractions. The books speak of a spiritual presence, a thing of darkness which stalks unhindered across all dimensions. It is said to be all-seeing and all-knowing. I can feel my mind losing its grasp on reality as I dig deeper and deeper into this madness. Reading aloud exacerbates the process, but also I sense a force <laughs> taking hold of my mind. Conveniently for me. by such thorough disquisition upon the Reading contents aloud. of these books that I believe I have found a solution to my wife's affliction. And yet, uh. now I begin to fear that it is far too late. Signed, Professor Theodore Westmark. I jumped. Change game category? There is none. They don't have it. Hello. Don't smash it. Hey, don't smash it. They wait patient and potent for here. Where the fuck is my mouse? Shadows only. I'm tired of these fucking Bitcoin miners, dude. Aiden XD, OJ Hype, Chad Reman, D10, D10. 25 months. Will you play Last of Us 2? Uh, yeah, maybe. Depends on how people think the game is. Because I haven't played the first one, so we have to do it. First one first. How do you view exploration? Interesting. Obstacle. Don't know. Don't know. How do you view obstacles? I don't know. What the fuck is an obstacle? Dreadful. Is free will real or just an illusion? I don't fucking know. Like, what are these options, dude? It's all in our minds. I don't know. Does it matter? 
Oh no, did I pick the less inventory now? Are you a careless person? I'm not gonna look at the thing. Am I a careless person? Wait, what is a careless person? A careless person is someone who doesn't care or is not careful enough. If you're careless, you don't give any fucks about anything. But you can also be careless and not be like in a careful way, right? Like, oh shit, he wasn't careful. You're making blunders. Yeah, exactly. It can be both. But I would say in general, I'm pretty careless, I guess. Is time relevant for pleasure? Is time relevant? I don't know. Quick is fun, I guess. The game needs a huge amount of patience and attention. Stay alert and vigilant to your surroundings in order to survive and finish the game. Westmark Manor is best played in the dark room with headphones on to get the best experience. Your destiny has been set. Don't guess. Alright then. Already lost. Lights off. The lights are off, dude. This is just how Sweden is. Dude, it's bright. Like f fucking like 11 p.m. This is how bright it is in Sweden. I'm not fucking shitting you, boys. This is how bright it is. 11 p.m. Sweden. Can't turn up the sun. get here what an odd place and it's dark I need to find light somewhere uh -huh. <laughs> oh no it's gonna be so scuffed notebook this is my dear old notebook my best friend in need when memory fails me all notes collected will be saved here get to the inventory by clicking tab get to the notebook by clicking N get to the map by clicking M you can also swap between these in the menus by pressing Q and E all right. First floor. Oh shit, is this permadeath? Pog. All right. Waking up in a place other than my bed was disconcerting. <laughs> <laughs> the noisome dark air filled me with dread. It is no mere darkness I see before me, I whispered to myself. Death itself. Welcome to you, Darkness. I'd rather avoid the deep unknown darkness if possible. My condition makes me stiff in fear if I subject myself in it for too long. I will need a light source to see what I'm doing in the room. Darkness can also be very scary in some places. And having a lantern help. Sss, plural. Find a lantern with oil and turn on lights with matches in some rooms in order to fight the dark ones and be able to find what you're looking for. Using matches on certain light sources can also help to find useful things in the room. Alright. So it's uh, like amnesia. Table. You found. Matches. Uh, some kind of god of war. Sigil. Sanity. This symbol represents your sanity. It's what keeps you going and keeps you alive. And once the sanity bar is empty, you will be lost in the darkness and will have to load your lost save or spend sanity points to revive you in the same room. You have sanity points now, and these are used toward things that have sanity costs, like saving at podiums. Spend these points wisely. 
wisely. Uh, it's like Resident Evil, you have to spend points to save. The dark makes it hard to see. I need some kind of light source, I guess. Ah! Tab. All right. Space. Combine. All right. It's Resident Evil. Boom. This lantern could be useful. Activate and deactivate lantern by pressing F. Light reveals hidden things in dark and protects you. Light source notes like the lan light sources like the lantern helps you traverse the space where darkness is affecting you. Lanterns can be turned on and off by pressing F. Yes. And inventory is good to have if you want to travel through dark corridors. Dark corridors. All right. Wait. Is this the Forsen build over here? I see. On my left. I guess not. Okay, so what is this? Identification kit. Can be used to reveal the true nature of an item. Oh shit, fucking Diablo scrolls. Door handle. Makes opening a door much easier. That's true. That is 100% true. El Diablo. Hey. Look at this posture though. You guys complain about my fucking posture. Motherfucker. Shrimps, thank you. TG Dynasty and Snee, welcome back. Strange. Strange. No door handle. Vigil Donald says, where's your snooze for, Ski? <laughs> Don't trip. <laughs> Anyone there? The British. <laughs> oh shit! I only have ten seconds. Oh shit! It's time based. What no. right then? Bollocks! Bollocks! Billowing wisps of damp air filled my lungs as I took in the familiar yet haunting atmosphere. I thought to myself that this may look and feel like fragments of the Westmark estate, but it is not. Welcome to Uganda. It is not. I'm locked in. The sigil on the door is a lock of some sort. The number on the door represents the toll to unlock it. I think getting enough sigils should break the lock. So I can escape this twisted place. You acquire sigils by completing puzzles in the house. You can see your accumulated sigils in the inventory menu and the number of sigils you need to unlock the door. Hmm. Very interesting. We have decided to move the launch of Kibberpunk 2077 from September 17th to November 19th. Thanks, Obama. Fuck this shit. So I've heard. So I've heard. I mean, uh, it only impacts you if you are jerking off to it. I'm still on the edge, on the fence about cyberpunk. I'm on the fence. That's why I don't get affected by that. The, those delays. Save your current progress. This will cost one sanity point. No, I don't think so. Wasting sanity points to save the game. Oh shit. But what if I die? What the fuck is this? Oh, my sanity. I ain't fucking saving the game in the start. Like what the fuck? This is an any percent run. Hello. You received a wooden handle. Ah. Uh, 
Okay. I guess he can't spend one second in darkness. Dark astrophobia. Is there a, such a thing? Uh huh. You received unidentified. Alright, let's see here. Back in my days in Diablo, we used to take this scroll of identification and then identify and I complain about shitty rolls. A thick lump of my old journal notes. Fucking useless, dude. Anglo-Saxon occult religion stemming as far back as the ancient Egyptian god Kuk, which means cock in Swedish, also spelled as Kek <laughs> or Kek U. Thank God it's not Kek W. All right, what the fuck is this game? Then? Wait, which one did I identify? This one? At least let me get some good stuff from it. I've heard of this Harbringer before, my research mentions it or him as Kronos, having the absolute power over time. The ritual of kindred sacrifice... That can't be how you spell sacrifice. Sacrifice. Sacrifice? Oh, that is how you spell sacrifice. Right? Sacrifice. No, it's not how you spell sacrifice. <laughs> sacrifice. Alright. Yeah, it's I, not E. Sacrifice. It's said <laughs> the ability to spawn Kronos into our reality. I wonder if anyone was able to do it. My studies also point to it being a thing of ancient knowledge and power. Supposedly able to travel through space and time, meaning our dimension could intermingle with others. I need to take a break from all this. My head is really not well right now. Okay, I am not happy I wasted one of my identification scrolls on that shit. Do I have to turn on? Where is that thingy with the, with the 10 seconds? Do you guys see that? Where was that? Did I go in here? No, he really doesn't like his blood. Urn. Herbal mix. Go vegan. <laughs> Take all. Run, tourist. Run into the forest, forest. Mm, that smell. Nothing you would want to set your teeth in, that's for certain. A kitchen for another purpose than to please the senses. And this smell I will never forget. This is why we go vegan. We have some matches, and my character is bugging out. Alright, I think I can save some of my shit now. Welcome to Uganda. Skeleton key, part with Roman eye. Lock winding key. Lock winding key. Stop your winding. Someone's preparing food there. The meat looks strange and smells bad. Do 
just check in my options. This looks odd. Who's there? Felix Ancient Transcript. Felix is the half god of storage and wealth. A smelly short little buyer traveling across the plains of existence, collecting goods and creating transportation across plains of existence. I feel like he's repeating himself every time. I feel like he's a half god bastard that has no stakes in the ancient bickering. He hates humans for his own gain and usually doesn't disclose his goals to humans. I did not know that. Hatch. Interesting. Leads to the other place like a shortcut, but fumbling in the dark is pointless. I need to find others before I can go anywhere. Ah, so it's like a shortcut thing, but I need to find the next portal. Uh -huh. You receive more tar. Ah! He's watching. What the fuck? That came out of nowhere, dude. What the fuck? Letter to Elizabeth. Elizabeth, my rosebud. Dear love, I struggle so. Having a bed-bound wife makes me yearn for intimacy once more. You have been sick for over a week and I have started to speak in tongues of which I cannot fathom. I cannot and will not send you off to the filthy alienists. Doctors who prod and torture for science. I am now off to start a search for cure myself since no one else is doing anything about this. Your husband and protectorate and Simpson. Wait, was that me? Did I write that? Did it say theater? Oh dude, this is fucking Dark Souls, man. I don't have a fucking hammer. But now we know. What well, happens if I fall down here? This is where she could should have come. Right? And and the and, and, and jump scare, right? Save your current progress. Uh, do I want to spend points? No, I don't think so. Because I need ten points to go through the door, and wasting one seems seems like you can soft lock yourself in this game. I would there be a need for something in me stuck? You're hungry. Is that what he said? What are you in need of? Storage. Tell me about you. <laughs> I might be sitting and staring, but you started staring first. You're not even looking at each other. Green team. Uh, my inventory space is not the best. I did this to myself, I guess. Sulfur. Combine this? No. Okay. 
I have no idea. Oh no. How much uh, can I refill my thingy with? Or rather, how do I refill it? Strange book with incantations. These words should not be uttered nor read. Voldemort. My my lantern is about to expire. Welcome to Yucanda. So how do I refill it? Oh, it refills automatically. Voldemort. Uh, Vision of Dolan says, "Don't you miss the sweet scent of fresh can of snooze?" Uh, the earthly aroma of the small packet as you press it against your gum. The slight buzz and euphoria as the Swedish gold calms your nerves. Please come back for us. General Snooze needs you. Uh, I remember it much better than you described it. It's love. Uh, you need a casket key to open it. Don't I have a casket key? It's, it's locked. What is this? Skeleton key. Okay. Hello. Plate. I can eat from these. Sort of God of War puzzle. Don't stand in the fucking. What do you want me to do, though? This is a very difficult puzzle, I must say. <laughs> Think I only need an axe to get through this one. I can just move this. I can move this over to the spikes. Yet to come across. Um, welcome to Yucanda. Um, question uh, 
Right. That place was fairly useless. What happened here? It's a lot of blood. The savage makes me nauseous. Yeah, then don't stand there. Sun symbol, sun symbol. Right. Check in here. <laughs> and a jumpers, lol. Identification kit. Elizabeth never liked this painting. Depicting alchemy devotees trying to find the Philosopher's Stone. Harry Potter. Bloody Mary. This looks strange. A smudge and dust mirror with faint reflection is staring back at me. Clean up the surface. Huh? Just my face. Nothing too disturbing about that unless you ask anyone else but me. Feels bad, man. Feels bad, man. Yeah, I really need a fucking axe. Small cock. Stop the 920. Ammonia. deep within us shall not be dragged out by the natural instinct of curiosity. I have had my fair share of problems, but sometimes faith in science is all we need. Love is all you need. Do, 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 do. Alright, we have some fucking TPs now. It's scary. This posture is truly scary. An alchemical workbench. Useful crafting kit I should take with me. Interesting. Your winter is full. So I can teleport to the fucking specimen, right? Damn. Skeleton key handle recipe. I, d I haven't seen a single puzzle yet. Not a single one. Crafting. Oh, now I see. Okay. Skeleton key. Jesus. This is ter <laughs> Terraria. Can craft my fucking armor set now. About to jump. Business as usual. Goodbye. Hello.
I need those for keys. I guess. This guy doesn't even react to that motherfucker. It's like... Good morning, wife. I think I can craft something, man. Rip, Rick, Rick, Rick. Receptacle. a hard word a place for gentlemen the smell of cigar smoke and cognac soaked into the walls here is where the important discussions took place and decisions were made how i used to wish to be a fly on these walls back then oh he's like a bitch servant Welcome to you, he's not the owner of this place or what you're better than this, son. You need to put in more effort. Whatever I do, it'll never be enough for you, father. Perhaps if you stopped fooling around with school assignments, you'd be prepared for what's to come. I'm only trying to help you reach the goal we have set ahead. But father, I'm already an A-grade student. Isn't that enough? Why do you pressure me to take on more than needed? When I am gone, the time will come for you to shoulder our family legacy. To face the struggle the Westmarks have fought for ages. I will not discuss this further right now, but trust me, it's for your own good. Parents always know best. Save your current no. I can not waste my points on that shit. at all what the fuck toad encyclopedia I don't know how to get get rid of shard. Like there's no tutorial telling me how to get rid of sharding. Welcome to Uganda. It's locked. Interesting. Okay. All right. 
I'm done. This fucking game sucks, asshole. Jesus Christ. That it was a terrible game, yo.